chopping up some meat here and some small little pieces. I'm Mark Bell, by the way, from SuperTrading.tv. And uh, I don't really have a wrap prepared, but I can try. Uh, I'm sliced and I'm diced, even though I eat buttloads of rice. Put your nuts and your weenus in a vice. I'm sick and tired of being nice. Is that any good? Anyway, I'm on my way to Cal Strength with my broski, Christopher the Boar Bell, and uh, Violent Mike, I mean Silent Mike. <clears throat> and uh, in our preparation to get up there, we're going to eat some meat. So I like to chop it up with some scissors, some cooking shears, as you can see here. Cha -cha -cha. We're cooking up some rice over here. As you can mm -hmm. see, it looks, looks like poop, actually. It's like a jubilee rice or something. It's kind of sort of a combination of brown rice and white rice. So now you can just copy what I do. You don't have to think about it. But this is pretty good. It's got uh, some fiber in it. Uh, three grams of fiber per serving. Make you blow it out a little bit. Also, this will be good for you guys to see. Let me wash my hands first. So I don't contaminate my stuff. Um, <clears throat> I made some... Uh, Ice coffee over here as I always do my jack and tan mixture protein powder and kathy I invented that by the way don't other people don't listen to other people trying to bullshit you on that I took some goddamn muscle milk in the year 1976 and I threw it into a shaker cup with some uh, iced coffee and blended it up it was the greatest thing I ever tasted remember that original muscle milk how good that shit was it looked like uh, it looked like the dirt that like night crawlers crawl around in for some reason, but later found out that it wasn't that great for you. Anyway, so I took some of this here and some protein powder. Where do you get that stuff? This is a uh, hydro way, but I mix this hydro way stuff from my friend at Muscle Whiz with my uh, BSN uh, Synthesix. I like this because it mixes up real thin. But I like the BSN because it's a little thicker, gives a little bit more substance. And mix it up. But I also use some almond milk. But this isn't just any ordinary almond milk because everything around here has to be overdosed, if you know what I'm saying. So we got a little funnel from bodybuilding.com. Thank you, bodybuilding.com. They only charged me nine bucks for this. Believe that? That's a great price. Nine dollars. Kidding, motherfuckers. It was free. Kidding me? I'm not going to pay nine bucks for a funnel. Anyway, so you got it like this. I got some hydro way. You guys kind of following me here? You see what's about to happen? Throw a little bit of this in there. Go like yay. And you can see how thin this protein powder is. That's why I'm a big fan of it. How did you milk that almond? Hey, <laughs> it wasn't easy, let me tell you. But you know what you do? You do what you have to do in life to get by. If I have to milk an almond to get some uh, protein that doesn't make me, or get some uh, milk that doesn't make me shit my pants, then that's what I'll have to do. And now, so we got some uh, almond milk that's spiked with some protein. You can see one gram, that's pathetic. Give me a goddamn break, almond milk. Almond breeze, you kidding me? One gram, only eight per the whole thing. Screw that, I threw two cups of this sucker in there. Threw one in there earlier, so there's 60 grammers in here now. Okay, you don't need to worry about grass fed. People are in their chemicals and all scared about chemicals. I fucking love chemicals. I love them too. All these people are on a juice. And I'm they're chemically about, enhanced. People yeah. are all on a juice and they're worried about fucking grass fed beef. <laughs> they're worried about what hormones they put in the meat and then they're fucking they got injecting like some them. dude across the street making their steroids in a tub. <laughs> <laughs> they're worried about Make, grass. Mixing shit up with olive oil. You're worried about grass fed meat. Look at our rice. Get some B roll that shit. Look at that. Here's some rice coming out. You ready? On our way to Cal Strength, we're going to go up there and uh, do some uh, deadlift demonstrations and stuff like that. And so so we don't eat bad on the road. We're going to eat here first. Hey, Mike, can you hand me my white monster? Or give me a dog penis red one instead, actually. Yeah, the dog penis red. Look at that external rotation. Yeah, oh, you know, never trust anybody who goes this way. Wait, what? Very aggressive. 
It's a very aggressive position. This way? For a, oh. That's what Joe Rogan said. Don't ever trust a guy. He said, ladies, look, just never trust a guy who jerks himself that way. I wouldn't even think about jerking myself that way. Bullshit. Thanks, Joe Rogan. Bullshit. Thanks. I've never had the Red Monster before. Everyone always tells me about it. It's pretty good. Well. It's dog penis red, though, at least. Why would... I just don't get the name Monster. Like, I get the name Monster, but... What is this? You never talked to Rob Monster? No. He's the owner. It doesn't have a flavor. It literally is just the white Monster. It's red. Well, that's what There's people... There's also a blue Monster. Oh, this is Ultra Red and Zero Ultra. What about the green Monster? That's got sugar in it. What is or that? the or the one eye monster? The one eye green monster? Man. Um 